Hello boys and girls! Welcome back to the Elder Scrolls. Um, last time I was here, I was dropping crap off. And this time, we are gonna start a DLC, actually. Um, I was thinking we should start with Knights of the Nine and then move on to either Mayroon's Razor or, um, it's not, that's not really a, like a DLC quest per se, but why am I, for some reason I'm poisoned or diseased. I don't even, yeah. Okay. Magic is coming back. Um, anyways, um, I lost my train of thought, but I don't think those are like really story kind of story based DLCs. Not that it's based around the story of uh, Elder Scrolls, but like, you know, has its own story. I'm not sure if May Runes is one of those. Knights of the Nine is, although it's based in Cyrodiil. And uh, Shivering Isles is its own, its whole own area. Like, it's a massive expansion. So, I think we're going to do um, Knights of the Nine first. And then we're going to do Shivering Isles. That's what I've decided as of right now. Executive decision. Let's go. Um, so the first quest, and I should say um, my recording software decided to not pick up the game audio at all. So I lost all of the Knights of the Nine and... A lot of Shivering Isles, not gonna lie. So I have done quite a bit of it, so I'm not gonna try and like fake it or anything. I, I just did it, like it was super recent too, so it's it's super annoying. Um, I'm sorry, but I, you know, I still want to record it. That's the whole point, right? Um, so I'm gonna be doing that. Uh, I'll try not to act surprised at stuff. <laughs> you know, I hate I, I hate that when you when you have to act surprised. It's kind of lame. So. Um, but I will, I will go through all the dialogue and everything again, you know, because, you know, why wouldn't you? Um, so the quest is called Pilgrimage. I've heard of a mysterious prophet who preaches outside the desecrated chapel of Debella in Anvil. I should find a way, I should find out if he knows anything about who attacked the chapel and why. So, let's head to Anvil. So he's outside. He's this guy. The Prophet. Oh my! <laughs> to what do I owe this honor? I am but a humble prophet. What business do you have with me? This guy's voice kills me. Just kills me. It's so bad, but so good. This is only the beginning. Umaril has returned, as foretold by Pelinal Whitestrake, in his dying breath. Who's Umaril? Umaril the Unfathered! The Sorcerer King of the Aliens, who ruled over this land for long ages before the rise of men. He was cast down by Pelinal Whitestrake. But Umaru's spirit survived, and now he has returned to seek vengeance upon the gods. Okay. Well, who's Pelinal? Oh, does no one remember the old tales? Saint Pelinal, the divine crusader of legend. Alicia's companion when she overthrew the rule of the Aliens 3,000 years ago. Pelinal, with the aid of the gods, fought the alien sorcerer King Umaril and slew him! But Umaril's spirit survived, and he has now returned. Okay, so he didn't kill him all the way then. 
Uh, just tell me who attacked the chat. Do you understand nothing? The blood speaks. I can read the ancient runes if you cannot. As Uibala, Umarale El Nada Rakuva. In the alien tongue, by the eternal power of Umaril, the mortal gods shall be cast down. A curse upon Umaril's ancient foes and a threat. So how do we stop him? Alas, Umaril cannot be stopped. Not without the aid of the gods, not without the Crusaders' relics. Without a champion, the gods are powerless to act. But who among us is worthy to wield the divine Crusaders' weaponry? I will quest for it, old crazy man. Have you heard it? Like, just listen to his voice, guys. It is incredible. His voice acting is top notch. Top notch. You would quest for the holy panoply of Pelinal White Strike? The legendary relics that have been sought by mighty warriors throughout the ages? Are you a worthy knight? I am the worthiest. Um. No, I have no claim to fame. Not unless the Grey Fox is a knight. No, I serve Sithis. Let's say that. Indeed. Huh. And yet you would seek the holy relics. The gods will find you an interesting plaything, I have no doubt. So how do, how do I find them, old man? The gods grant insight to those they deem worthy. Why and how they act is not predictable. What I can tell you is that, <clears throat> traditionally, knights who wish to quest for the relics would walk the pilgrim's way, travel to the way shrines of the Nine Divines, pray to each of the gods in turn, and ask their favor upon your quest. If the gods deem you worthy, you will be granted a sign. Go forth with the Nine's blessings. I shall. I shall go forth. And I shall find the relics. The weapons and armor of Pelinal Whitestrake. Alicia's comrade granted to him by the eight divine. He went alone into the white gold tower, challenged the alien sorcerer King Umeril to single combat, and slew him! Alas, Umeril was not truly slain, but only cast beyond the bounds of Nern. And now he has returned to wreak his vengeance upon the gods, as was prophesied by Pelinal himself with his dying breath. Only a true knight, wielding the holy relics of the Divine Crusader, has a chance to defeat Umaro. But alas for Tamriel, the Crusader's relics have been lost for many an age. Who now can succeed in the quest for the relics? Where the greatest knights of legend all failed. Um, me? Once there were eight divines. Then Tiber Septum became Talos. And the eight became nine. I followed the old way of honoring the eight while also giving due to Talos, the one who ascended. Uh, let's ask about the pilgrimage. For those who would repent their past deeds, walking the pilgrim's way is a traditional way to cleanse yourself before the gods. 
Follow the map I gave you. Visit the way shrines of the Nine. Pray and wait for a sign. Okay, let's ask about Ubo. He was defeated, but not destroyed by Pelinol the Crusader. Now he has returned to seek vengeance against the gods. Only a true knight, welding the holy relics of the Divine Crusader, has a chance to defeat Umaril. Okay. May the eight and one guide your steps. Let's go walk the Pilgrim's Path or the Pilgrim's Way. And, um... I wouldn't go in there unless you have a strong stomach. We have orders to leave everything just the way it was until the investigation into the chapel attack is finished. Okay. Leave me alone. Maybe I won't go in there. Let's go walk the Pilgrim's Way. So, he gave us a map. Uh, we have to go to these way shrines. So we have to start with RK. We're going to do RK, Mera, Debella, Akadosh, Julianos, Canareth, Talos, Zenithar, Stendar. And only then shall the way be revealed. Ah! So, RK. Shouldn't be too hard to find. It's like a little closer to Kavach. Oh, Jesus. I don't want to be out in the rain. Uh, please, I uh, know. No more rain, please. Oh. Come on. Come on. 10 a.m.? Oh, my. Okay, so it should be up. Up ahead. And to our left. Necessary. I'm going to kind of go off the road a bit here. I think it's this way. From what I can remember. No, oh, I think I screwed it up. I think it's down here, actually, towards... Uh... It's not that. harder to find than I thought and I've already done this oh I think uh, that's it that's it okay I think actually that might be the wrong one it needs to be of RK I think this is the wrong one I somehow remember there being one to like Canareth or something around here. Oh, never mind. It is the right one. Okay. I'll take it. Okay, there's Numero Uno. The second one is outside Skingrad. I know that. Or I, I think. Can't quite remember. Yes, yeah, Skingrad. Mera. Okay. So, let's head this way and a bit north. I don't think this one's all that difficult to find. Yeah, it's right there. This one's an easy one. The problem with that map, though, is that they're not really where they say they are. They're kind of in, like, you know, like in the vicinity, but they're not great maps. It's like crudely drawn maps. Okay, there's Mera. Now I don't know where the next one is. Debella's outside Coral. 
Let's head to... Is it Wayne and Priory? Yeah, Wayne and Priory. And then go south, I think? Yes, pretty much directly south. Careful not to miss up. Oh, can't miss that. I like uh, I like when I find it right away because I can't remember where they are. So it's nice to find it. Okay, there's Debella down. Now Julianos, I think. Oh no, Akdash. Outside Bruma. Bruma. This one's really hard to find, actually. Um, so we head south, then down the mountain. I somehow remember it being along the path, maybe? But I'm not 100% certain. I'm not 100% on a lot of things. This is just another one added. Oh, jeez, right here. Okay, there's Akatosh. Man, Shadow Me is the best. Uh, next one is Julianos, just outside the Imperial City. Down from Fort Magia. Actually, let's go from er, Empty Mine. Uh, so I think I want to go south. Yes, south. Pretty sure if I just keep heading this way, I'll eventually run into it. Um, yes, I will. I will indeed. Am I wearing greaves? Oh, I am. Okay. Good to know. Let's head south. And we're trying not to draw like monster aggro. Because it, for some reason, whatever reason, I don't know, the game loves to give you aggro, but it won't like, it won't take it off you. Not exactly sure why, but you'll see like enemies are nearby. There's no enemies anywhere near me. I wish it was like the fallout system where if they've lost sight of you, you can wait. I'm pretty sure you can do that. I th think you can do that. The next one's right here. I remember that. So we gotta get, we gotta head more. Oh, I guess east is fine. Pretty much straight. I'm trying to remember now if you can wait while enemies are nearby. I honestly can't remember. And I just played it. God, my memory's the worst. I honestly wouldn't be surprised if I've already forgotten some stuff in this DLC. I'm telling you guys, my memory is the worst. The worst when it comes to like games and movies. It's honestly kind of nice, kind of like an insight into me, I guess, but I am extremely forgetful about like key plot points and stuff. I don't know why, but it's really difficult for me to remember that stuff. Maybe I don't care enough. I don't know. Maybe I'm not invested en enough. Like, I can think of recent games even like... Well, even Fallout, well, Fallout 4, I remember pretty much all the points, but I'm thinking like Bioshock Infinite, even Bioshock 1, like I'll forget major points. And they're two of my favorite games. Does anybody else have this problem? 
if someone's watching this right now, I'd love for you to comment. Like, how, what's your memory when it comes to movies and video games? I'm talking like story elements, even gameplay elements, stuff like that. Like, I was thinking about this in in regards to um, CSGO, even. I play it, it's, I don't know, I must have like 800 hours by now. And I, I've reached, like, Supreme. And the other day we were talking about how we miss, like, uh, post-game voice chat. And we were trying to remember if there was halftime voice chat. And none of us could remember. <laughs> And, like, we've played that game hundreds and hundreds of hours. Majority of them were when the game had voice chat between teams. And we couldn't remember. Very odd, I found, you know. Very odd. Very peculiar. Anyways, I think we're here. Now the thing is just finding it. I want to say it's this way. And I feel like I'd be totally wrong. No, nope, I'm right. Look at that. Ah, oh, stupid Timberwolf. Oh, come on. Oh! Shadow mirror, dude, work, son. Okay, I don't know where the next one is now. Next one's kind of close. Uh, it's this way. Pell's Gate. What a what a great pun. I don't know if it's like what a Pell is though. Is that a thing? Is it, or it might be a person. Could, you, could that even be a pun? Is that a pun? Let me know down in the comments below if that's a pun. <laughs> oh. Uh, sir? Hello? Why is there just some random minotaur? Oh, and then like crab legs over there. What the fuck? Jameis Winston. Um, no. This one. Crap. I don't remember where this one is. I want to say it's this way. Her sign. Oh, there it is. Okay, perfect. I love the random wildlife. They just threw it in here. It's totally pointless in this game, but they just... Well, maybe not pointless. I mean, there's hunters in this game, now that I think about it. You run into a hunter every once in a while. Ah, uh, next one. Zenithar is outside... What is that? Breville? Oh, killed it. Outside Breville. What? No way it's right here. <laughs> and it just turns me looking right at it? Okay. Wow, I did not know that. That's awesome! <laughs> okay, well, if you want... Go to Flooded Mine if you want to find that one real fast. And then Stendar is between Breville and... What is that? Uh, Skingrad. Ah, Leo in. Damn it. I blew it. I blew it. Uh, so I want to head north. Yes, north. I think it's just along the road, too, so. Shouldn't be too hard to find. Keep an eye on the left side here.
This is a really annoying part of the quest. <laughs> Why do they make you do this? Well, I, I know why they make you do it, but... I mean, I don't even know. Could they have not added a shrine, like, to one of the people? Like, maybe a shrine to Pelinal? Just made me pray at that. I've prayed at the Way Shrine of Sendar. I've completed my pilgrimage to the Way Shrines of the Divines. I should pray and wait for a vision to guide me on my quest for the Crusader's relics. Hail, knight! You seek my relics with a worthy heart. Okay. Your prayers have woken me from my endless dream. Or perhaps you have entered my dream and I still sleep. I think others have sometimes spoken to me. Others like you, but my memory is doubtful. Perhaps the others came after you. Your need must be great for the gods to allow us to speak. Has Umaril the Accursed found a way back? The fairest of a foul race. A thousand curses upon his unholy name. I thought I'd won, but I should have known no. The slave masters are a cunning breed. Umaril found a way to cheat death as I could not. If you would seek for my relics, I know little that can help you. All that has passed since my death is like mist that my mind cannot take hold of. My friends built a shrine upon the site of my death, where the elves tormented me in a final act of revenge. I can show you where it once stood. Perhaps it is there still. Fare thee well, sir knight. May the gods grant you Destroy Uber utterly. As I 